in each one of these areas choose a nodal institution. Astrophysics in the in, like a second Indian Institute of Ayuka in or Indian Institute of Tropical Meteorology in Pune in the case of uh, uh, climate science or regional center for biotechnology in the case of uh, biology you can have subsidy center main data set bases will be located there but in the Shastri Park which is the headquarters of NKN we will keep a mirror site Anybody connected to an NK node can access this data. And if you want to do more careful, want more information, then you can go on to the database center, which has domain, domain knowledge. This is a uh, thing which I got from Professor Vijay Raghavan, Professor K. Vijay Raghavan, Secretary DBT. How? Oh, this, this is a nature index. And you can see India has collaborated with a large number of US and Germany, UK, France, and this is only going to grow. And today's India is able to give as much to the world as it wants to take from it. And finally, let me come to my last slide. All of us want India to become a knowledge economy. First a developed world, then you become a knowledge economy. Able to generate knowledge, are able to also to appropriate knowledge generated in any part of the world for which you need this excellent r and ecosystem packed by high quality manufacturing skills. And we must take, particularly young people must take the opportunity of the large number of scientists you meet here, both from India and from abroad, or scientists also, to establish uh, relationships See, the ultimate analysis, science is done by scientists. And collaboration is among scientists. Institutions can give you the support, but finally it boils down to individual scientists. And I'm sure the Science Congress has given you an opportunity. Of course, so many meetings take place in specific domains. All those opportunities we must now make use of in order to establish more and more international partnerships for mutual benefit. No partnership is sustainable unless it is mutually beneficial. And I have a feeling India can give as much as it wants to take from the world. Thank you very much.